Light versus Garcia at the ABA in Auckland, New Zealand. I'm Isaac Savage, and with me tonight, none other than the champ himself, Chop Chop Chad Mills. Welcome here tonight, 99 fight, 2015 Oceania champ, and 2014 Commonwealth quarterfinalist. Chad, welcome here tonight. Oh, cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Awesome to be here. Anox Lai here, tail of the tape, 17 years old against Henry Wilson, 19, 185 versus 178 and 185 reach versus 180 for Henry Wilson. The younger of the two there, Onyx Lai, but such an aggressive fighter, well accomplished amateur fighter, but take nothing away from Henry Wilson. This is going to be an absolute barn burner of a fight, Chad. Yeah, it is. Uh, you know, Onyx has through the years, you know, he's really developed, and you know, he's coming into coming into himself, and um, and he's he's a uh, very aggressive fighter from Whangarei. Lots of punches, you know, punches and bunches. Very aggressive. Uh, I think it's going to be a good bout. Any fighter too coming out of Wellsford is always game. They've always got a high caliber and a, an aggression that I uh, I don't see out of too many boxing gyms. Uh, Wellsford always produce some very hungry, vicious fighters. Yeah, they do, and you know, Onyx is no exception. Here we go now at Peach Boxing, Light vs Garcia. This is a three-rounder. These guys are coming out at 81 kilograms. Expect this fight to have fireworks tonight. Onyx Light, always aggressive, always comes out vicious. But Henry Wilson knows what he's in for and is definitely going to take it to Onyx Light here tonight. Yeah, he's going to have to. He's going to have to give Onyx something to think about before, so you know, so he doesn't have the confidence to just run in and, and, and throw punches and bunches like he does. And a southpaw as well. That's the first southpaw we've had tonight, and you know, it changes the whole dynamics of the bout a lot more. You know, it makes it more about boxing. You know, unless they choose not to. <laughs> well, just to, you, you're totally right. It can change a fighter's game plan you know he's going to have to move different angles to deal with the southpaw tonight with that right hand jab coming out there from Henry Wilson yeah that's it you know and and being you know the southpaw if if Onik moves you know to, to towards his backhand you can walk into it like a, a, a left. hard left hand you know and then and then a right hook as he exits off and it's we just, did see him catching a left early there in the round there Chad yeah that's it let's see if if Henry you know takes advantage of his you know southpaw stance just as we said, that a nice overhand right there landing uh, from Onyx Lai there on Henry. But, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see Onyx will have to keep moving to the left hand of his side, not ever to the right because he could walk into a left hook. Yeah, yeah, so he's going to want to keep his front foot on the outside and, you know, come on in, on that angle and get on the outside so he can land, you know, land a right hand down the middle and then throw the left hook. And there we go. That's what he needs to do. Right hand. Loving the aggression here from Onyx Light. You know, we talk about having to move different angles. Sometimes it doesn't matter if you're you're super aggressive because you just don't care. You'll take one to get one. Yeah, that's it. You know, with the southpaw, it looks like Henry likes to box, you know, the southpaw style. And and Onyx, you know, boxers typically the southpaws, they don't like, you know, the aggression. They don't like to be out in close. They want to be outside long, using that long backhand. And, you know, Onyx is taking that away from him. And that's what he needs to do. Big, uh, big right there too from Onyx is charging and you know we talk about uh, you know maturity and experience I cannot believe this guy's only 17 years old he's fighting like an absolute grand man here tonight yeah fiery young fella and he has been fighting already for a few years already uh, you know even though he is 17 he, he fights like an adult and he's been in the game for a wee while now and aggressive first round there I'd have to give that to Onyx Lie, but Henry Wilson definitely make it challenging for Onyx right there in that round number one. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, Onyx has you know put his stamp on the bout. He's he's doing what he wants to do. He's doing what he's good at, which is get inside and rough him up. You know, Henry is going to have to try and use a bit more angles, you know, and, and use that long left hand and try keep Onyx outside. What I love about Onyx too, he's quite a rare mix of a boxer 
was, uh, you know, aggression. Sometimes it's either one or the other. You know, you've got a technical boxer, they don't have too much power. Onyx seems to have the uh, capability of both. He's got the aggression, but he's got that technical nous as well. Yeah, that's great. You want to be able to do both. I mean, it's an advantage to be able to box, be able to fight inside, to be able to move. Uh, you know, got to be able to change to what's in front of you. Uh, but, you know, for him today, he's got to do what he does best. Saying that too, it's always tough fighting a south ball. We've got Henry Wilson coming out here now in the blue. He'll be jabbing with the right, trying to clip Onyx there with the left. But Onyx coming out very quick and heavy with the body shots. And ducking and weaving, coming out of the way of those shots, but did get clipped. Nice movement there from Henry Wilson. Now starting to read a little bit more body movement from Onyx Lai. Yeah, that's what he's going to want to do. He's going to want to, you know, keep the drama low, you know, keep keep the bout pace slow so that he can take advantage of a southpaw stance. You know, more drama is not what Henry wants. This is not where he wants to be. Should tie up, wait for the break, and then get that space back and go back to work. Beautiful aggression there from Onyx. He's definitely the busier of the two. Coming forward, throwing punches and bunches. Yeah, that's it. And he's working the body as well. You know, working the body is going to make Henry stand still. You get shots to the body, you don't want to move your feet as much. And, you know, and, and, and Onyx is uh, he's investing in hitting that real estate down below. Beautiful left hook there from Onyx on the chin of Henry. And, you know, he would have felt that. He's still standing strong. The fitness is, is there. But you know what, what it feels like when you get hit with one of those shots, Chad. It uh, does take the knees and, uh, you know, energy from you. Yeah, it does. That's it. And he's starting to land it over and over again, that left hook over the top. And as well as being the aggressor, you know, he's in his element right now. He's, he's pouring it on. And this is what he used, you know, this is what he's used to. Beautiful. And as up, well as being the aggressor, he decides when the action takes place. And, you know. Big shot there, too, again for Monos. It. I'm actually loving the aggression back, back from Henry. He's just, He's saying, you know, whatever you can do, I can do better. And he's giving it back to Onyx Lai. He's definitely not going down out of fight. Yeah, you can see it in his face. He's really he's gritting his teeth, you know. He's firing back. And, you know, to be able to stand there and go to war with Onyx is no easy task. So, loving what Henry's doing so far in this fight. And certainly give it to Onyx Lai here tonight. Big shot. Oh, right on the bell. Two rounds down, so Onyx is he's, this is his this is his game. This is what he loves. Once again, Onyx lie outside of the ring, a true gent. But once that bell rings, he turns into an absolute demon. Seems like a bit of a trait with you, uh, you fighters, Chad. You'd be you'd be the same in the ring yourself. <laughs> I, I, I guess so. I don't know. Some say a bit of a show pony sometimes, though. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that, and. Like, what a star set uh, packed lineup we have tonight. Still on the cards Jerome Pampaloon, Francis Whitey, Andre the Renegade Mikhailovic against Nick Taylor. 60 plus kickboxing fights now turned to boxing. And we can't forget the main event David the Great White Light against Jaman Albon Bon Garcia. Seven KOs, Chad, coming to take the strap from our Kiwi boy. How do you think it's going to go down? Oh, well, gotta got to back my mate Dave, but. Uh, Jaman, all his wins are by knockout, so we at least know he can punch. Here we go now for the third and final round. Onyx Lai there in the red against Henry, the Southpaw Wilson there in the blue. Contestable fight so far, Onyx being the aggressor, but Henry making this a bit of a hard road for Onyx here tonight. Yeah, that southpaw, you know, just makes it a little bit more awkward with the shot from Onyx. But, you know, he's still landing successfully. He never takes his foot off the gas, does he? To Onyx is moving forward, left hand, right hand, one, two, uppercut. That's right. Well, what I was saying earlier was, you know, he's the aggressor and he's the one that's making the decision when the action takes place, you know. And when you're in control, you're fighting when you want to fight. And that's... You know, you can you can keep your gas going. It helps you, your gas tank lasts a bit longer when you're fighting when you want to fight. And then as for Henry, you know, he's being forced to fight, and that takes a lot out of you. There's some things you just can't teach. You know, we throw these combinations, you learn these drills, but he throws one, two, and then comes back with the right hook. It's a little bit unorthodox, but I love the aggression there from Onyx. 
Yeah, and he's, he's been he's having success with that uh, left hook over the top of the right hand of Henry. He's, he's landed a few good ones tonight uh, with that shot. And look, he takes one and comes forward again. He just doesn't want to go down. He's one of those fighters that will go out in a body bag. You can even see, too, the uh, fatigue setting in for both guys, but more so from Henry. And it takes its toll, doesn't it? You know, once you start getting bombed and peppered up, regardless if you want to throw, yeah, so it gets Onyx hard. Is, Onyx has really been making him work tonight, and you can see that, you know, it's taken its toll on him. He's starting to fatigue from all that body work, all that aggression, you know, all that inside, little wrestling on the inside, it all takes it out of you. Big right there from Onyx. Lie. Landing on the head there of... Henry Wilson. Final 10 seconds. And there's on it's putting the stamp, putting his stamp on this bout. Oh, and a few shots there oh, by Henry. Nice Lewis. finish there from both boys. Beautiful display of sportsmanship. Strong finish from both boys. I'm not going to call the card just yet, but what a fight. And for all those watching back home, wherever you are in New Zealand, the North Island, North Shore, West Auckland, East Auckland, South Auckland, Central, and all those down south and abroad in Australia, America. We welcome you, you here tonight. Isaac Savage and Chad Chop Chop Mills bringing you this entertainment tonight. What a fight that was. Here we see the action now. Both boys throwing just as the round ended that head kick in the face of Onyx Live. But what a fight that was, Chad. Yeah, it was a great bout. Both boys, you know, exchanging leather. Uh, and but Onyx just, who was in his element tonight, right in there, right on the front line, letting his hands go. Well, first and foremost, I know you'd like to congratulate both our fighters in that great encounter, two and the only one, Benji, not the smile of the vision. Please put your hands together, Onyx Lai and Henry Wilson. Ladies and gentlemen, here at the ABA, their judges have scored the contest, a unanimous victory. And from the ring corner of the Wellsford, the winner is on its line. A little one here for us to take away, and thanks very much to you, Henry. Some people were just born to fight, and at 17 years old, he's looking like he has been in there for many, many years. Onyx Lie out of Wealth's boxing. What a future he's got ahead of him. Here we go now, ringside. Congratulations there to Onyx Light out of Wellsworth Boxing. And a shout out to, to some of our fans watching back home. Mark Cadell, 